This week, Honda draws our interest with a clandestine look at its all-new Honda Accord. But first, we take a sneak peek at the Japanese automaker's future vision of personal mobility. At first glance, Honda's new UniCube looks like a seated Segway scooter. Honda says it has the same freedom of movement a person enjoys while walking. The personal mobility device with an ultra compact design and comfortable seat is a progression of the U3X Honda showed back in 2009. It features several proprietary systems that allow balance control and omnidirectional driving. No word on pricing from Honda as of yet or if it will be available in the States. Not so far off, but still under wraps is the all-important mid-size 2013 Honda Accord Coupe and Sedan. Our iSpy photos show both the two and four-door. And while camouflaged with psychedelic-looking swirls, the two-door looks faithful, if less daring, to the red and chrome-laden coupe concept showed at this year's Detroit Auto Show. It's hard to distinguish the spy car's contour lines because of the attention-grabbing camouflage. But we did a mock-up of the vehicle, rendering it in a solid white. And it would be hard to deny our iSpy photos are not the production-ready version of Honda's ninth-generation Accord. On the outside, the 2013 Accord looks very evolutionary and less daring than rivals Hyundai Sonata and Ford's new Fusion. Also, unlike those two, the new Accord will be available with a V6, along with a highly efficient four-cylinder, plus a plug-in hybrid due next winter.